see me. I don't know for sure. Just, just kind of guessing. Uh, you know, most people, when a relative dies, you get some clothes, some furniture. I got about a thousand video games in a car. I'm sorting through N64 games right now. This is the great crusade of sorting video games. Got about oh, I want to say 50 or so Super Nintendo games against the wall over there. I'm mean, gonna say that's it. I mean, I got systems up to a zoo, and this is probably gonna take a while. So I'm starting this and doing this as a video blog to kind of just kind of pass the time a little bit, keep things mobile. Wave Race 64, anyone? And stuff that I didn't think existed, like... Wait a minute. This is a Super Bomberman Party Pack. Now, the game isn't in here, but what is in here is this multi-tap plug-in for a Super Nintendo system. There really aren't as many of these instruction booklets as I'd like there to be, because there's a lot of these games, and a lot of them are in these used packages, so the books didn't come with them. So, granted, I'm not getting the, the same kind of quality that I think I would normally. I got three copies of Ocarina of Time. Who needs three copies of Ocarina of Time? If you want to play it three times, which I've played it more than that, you certainly don't need three copies to do it. Star Wars. Star Wars. Star Fox, there's, uh, uh, two copies of that. Do a barrel roll. Fuck. Do a barrel roll. Pilot Wings. I've got about three copies of this for Super Nintendo, and, and probably another three for the 64. Yoshi Story. Cool way out of a Pepsi bottle. N64 boxes. I didn't know there was a Paperboy 64. Looks just as creepy as the old one. Tornadoes? Vampires? No ghosts. I don't know why this box is so big. Ah, Rumble Pack. That's why it's big. Might have been the, one of the first Rumble Packs. Who knows? It's a great find. Two copies of Wave Race. I think I hit a book before. Can't remember. I have more games than boxes and books. That's not good. Who's gonna buy Scooby-Doo? Here's some nice finds. Look at that, look at that. Fit in this end either. Look at that. Uh, three copies of this one. I really think these boxes were made so you can't keep them. It's impossible to get these games in here. <clears throat> I don't even know if they, they work. I don't even know how they got them in. But, oh wait. Hey. Didn't see that coming. I think a lot of the games that don't have books have player's guides, but that's a whole nother day. Yep. Why did some of these come out? Some of these aren't even made to come out. Some of them are just like little built-in machines. This one comes out. It's like the obscure ones come out. The nice ones don't. Now I see there's two games, I think. And one Diddy Kong Racing game, two boxes, but... I think any game where your best friend is a giant Hindu elephant... That's fucked up. Earthworm Jim. This was good on the on the Super Nintendo, but not so good on the 64. Can't take the thingy out. I don't even have this game. At least, like, unless I find it somewhere. 
GT64 obscure game comes out of the box. This one's got a nice plastic -y thing on it. As for what we think about education in this country, a school bus, bus with machine guns on it, definitely at the top of the list. Four copies of Pilot Wings. Mario 64 comes out. It's hit or miss. Receipt for buying Star Fox. I'm actually surprised at how many Star Wars there, games there were over the years. Two copies of this one. Okay, so end of day three, I believe. We've got Super Nintendo's. Uh, assorted, semi-alphabetized Super Nintendos. The boxes were alphabetized as well. Uh, there's a system. There's five more systems. Uh, some assorted ones, those are boxes. Some, some of them have games, some of them don't. Some of them have books and just boxes and that kind of thing. 64 games in boxes and 64 games in semi boxes and a couple controllers holding them up. And the last bit of today, which is these games and the games that don't have boxes, assorted, tagged with their name. A couple of them still have books. I've got this book, but I don't have the game. And that's pretty much it. Uh, tomorrow is probably going to be. Genesis games, which all the Sega Genesis stuff is everywhere. There's some there. Uh, let's see. There might be some Genesis stuff in there. Ooh, a 3DO. Uh, what's in here? This is for a Genesis, I believe. Um, maybe. Oh, there's a Genesis. Console. What do you know? 16-bit. There's a 32-bit thing over there. Uh, 64 controller. I'll probably be setting the 64 up pretty soon. I'm itching for some golden eye. Uh, there's a few Genesis boxes. It's the regular Nintendo. That's kind of last. There's more Genesis boxes. So, yeah, as you can see, that's... Genesis stuff is kind of everywhere. Hope there's some more. We've kind of made a complete circle now. Uh, so yeah, day three.